A Doll's Day. Okay, so we're going to be opening these two today. Um, I showed you in the last video that we had bought these from Target. So let's just see how they look. I'm going to... Um, I'm going to pause and then open because these packages usually take really, really long to get open. So, we'll be right back in an instant. Ta-da! They're open. So, as you can see, I got them open. Okay, so she came with a scarf. Barbie came with a scarf. I don't like that the needles were in it because they damaged it. Um, but otherwise, it's a scarf, not soft on the other side, a trophy, her, um, board, and these mittens, these are like hard rubber mittens, um, right now they're on with rubber bands, so I'll just leave it on, actually, I'm going to take it off because I want to see if she has, uh, she has the jointed wrist, so that's good. Because I have a doll that is not. Yeah, see, this is not a made to move doll. Um, made to move dolls have different kinds of joints compared to this. They're, they're the little elbow joints and little knee joints. Let me just focus. Um, and no, she doesn't have the knee joints. As you can see, they're the regular knee joints. Let me get grab another doll so I can show you. Let me just cover her up. Hi. Jeez, these pants are tight. But I love the color of them. The color's great. Let's check her ankles. shoes are split they are very hard to get off her ankles are not she has flat feet and her ankles are not um, made to move okay so let me show you a made to move doll real quick oh, I'm gonna close her shirt let me there she's completely covered up Okay, I got this doll at a secondhand store, and she is one of the made to move dolls. So you can see she has the adjustable ankles, the knee joints has like a knee, and the elbow joints have like an elbow. So this doll is not a made to move doll, even though I thought she was. Um, she's still positionable, which is good. Um, just not a made to move doll. Actually, I don't really like the way the made to move dolls look. Just because when you have them dressed, as you see here, uh, their joints don't look very nice in a po posed position. Having these really ugly joints showing, I don't like that. So, um, when I use these dolls, this is the way I got this one in this dress, so I haven't changed her or anything yet. When I do use these dolls and I pose them, I always pose them in outfits like this so that you can see their joints. Um, but uh, this doll has got to gotta be a... Um, she's a pretty good made-to-move doll. Um, she doesn't have the waist made-to-move. The waist is not. Uh, neither is the upper... Wait, no, yes, the upper is the, her elastic on her dress is caught. So the upper part of her body is adjustable. So that's how the made to move ones go. And this one's, even though it's, it looked in the box like it was a made to move doll because of the way she was positioned, but not an actual made to move doll. 
Now this stuff. The reason why I got it was because I absolutely loved her little outfit. It's so cute. You see, um, her face is cute too, and she has beautiful hair. I like how she has a little pink going through her hair. Um, her little clip, it's cute. Uh, her, her eyes are just so huge. Um, her, she has little cute shoes, those are cute. She comes with this little hedgehog. Don't know why. Um, wait, why are we out of focus? Oh, there. Um, there's that. She comes with a little pot of plant, I guess, a little brush. And she comes with these. They're like felt stickers. Don't know why. But anyways, um, her clothes is removable because that's what I'm going to be using her for. I didn't buy the doll to keep the doll. I just bought the doll for the outfit. I'm going to be keeping the outfit only. So, I'll be getting rid of the doll. She's a cute doll, but it's not something I can use. So, she'll be going. Bye-bye. Okay, I had a helmet, but I completely lost it for this doll. No idea where it went. Um, she has this... It took me like 20 minutes to get these two dolls out of their box. And still they have these clips on them. I gotta take this off. Okay, so her hair is a light blonde. Um, she's very light makeup. Um, so I really don't usually keep my dolls with blonde hair. She'll probably have her head removed and a new head placed on this body so that I could have a moving Barbie. But we'll see which one. I don't know which doll head would actually match her skin tone. And I don't know what happened to her helmet. It's just gone. I just got to look for that real quick. Um, it's just completely gone. I think it's on the floor, but I haven't moved anything on the floor and it's nowhere to be seen. So, um, that's it for that. Let's see what else I have to show you. Okay, so this is an Anna Klein Barbie that I got at a secondhand store and the reason why I bought her is because I absolutely love her black hair and her outfit is great so I'll be using that not at all though I'm pretty sure she's just straight arms straight legs so her head will probably be swapped out with a made to move Barbie doll this one is a Barbie spring doll she has a green shawl and her dress is like just up to her knees. So I like that. It's pink and teal and I liked it. And then there's this one is a Valentine's. Um, I th it's a Valentine's dress. Now it is kind of short but I really like the design of it. So, I figured I could use it to make a di dress a different length, but the same style at the top and the front. And this one is basically the same as that first dress at the beginning with the open skirt at the top and then the skirt underneath. But I like the top part, um, the bodice and the sleeves, which are great ideas for making clothes. So I purchased those two, those actually those three dolls online on eBay. This one is a Barbie Fashion Avenue accessory bag, accessory box. Now it just has a cardboard purse in it. Um, the hat is very delicate and so is the purse. And then we have the little golden or green shoes. This one, this one is a Generation Girls. Um, from Barbie, it has the red shirt, which is separate from the button-up shirt, 
and the denim pants with some tennis shoes and glasses. Really great set to dress up your male dolls. Here is a shot of the dolls I collect. These are some heart dolls. Um, soft body. Um, I like what I have. And uh, every once in a while I see another one I like. So I pick it up. But next video will be coming soon. Bye. See? It's nowhere to be seen. I dropped the helmet down there. But I can't see it anywhere. I have no idea where it went. I swear, so many times I drop things and they just go into the Twilight Zone. Anyways.